is our main table. We're having uh, Jerome Bastogne on the left hand side, and on the right hand side we have uh, Emmanuel no. De Wolf. In fact, and Jerome is on Red Mono Red Phoenix. Sometimes, since it's uh, top eight. Which room we already see the Steam King on the battlefield and the monster Swiss Swift Spear. The backup match is the uh, number two versus number seven seed. Which is Olivier Guillaume versus Jeroen Guillaume on Monogene Tron and Jeroen Seyer also with, in fact. Apparently it was a good choice. Yeah. Because they're already... There uh, were I can check how many there, there are in top 8. Five, five infect players and... There are three of them are in top 8. So today, infect was a good choice. So I guess the Glacier Elf got captain for one poison because the spell scan was cast. Yeah. Counter on Steam King. Looks good, he's on a runaway Steam King. Yeah. It's quite the roadblock. Mm -hmm. <laughs> spell scan. Is that common to have a spell skate uh, main deck for the impact players? Uh, I guess so, because they don't want their creatures to get destroyed. Yeah, of course. <coughs> How many? Uh, I can check. Only one. So he's quite lucky. <coughs> he has it in the open. Yeah. yeah, and we saw it in his previous games too. Uh, yes, yeah, but he has also two on sideboard, so maybe it was a sideboard yeah. game. But like... How come... Are they not keeping the dice, track with the dice? I think uh, Emmanuel is at 17 at the moment. I don't think... There was no attack. Jerome didn't attack. He did attack. Turn one, he attacked with his fifth spear. Turn two, he went, uh, went Monomorphose into a Steamkin. And then he didn't attack with he didn't, the Steamkin. Yeah, but he did attack with the Swiss spear, so that's two. Did he, I don't think he attacked with the Swiss, Swiss spear. We shall see. <laughs> <laughs> Not pump it with the pendle even first. I would, if I was Jerome, I would take the straight, I guess. Easy. So now you have to spend the pump spell to get rid of the blocker. Oh wait. One more fools. That's bad. And uh, doesn't yeah. matter. It still gets the job done. I've not seen this deck, by the way. It's a monolith Phoenix set. It's cool. Yeah, it's a nice deck. Wow, I'm not even willing to trade something for... Trade a bond spell for the Steam King as a whole. Yeah, yeah. the Steam King is, I think, for... Re not really, maybe, but important enough to... Uh, make sure it dies. And if you had a pump spell, you also like, yeah, 
now he has she survived. Lethal on him. But that I did, yeah, sure. But why don't doesn't he just bump it with Mendelhaven and then attack? That's a three four. He wanted maybe to keep the steam in control. Yeah, it's in control, when it, uh, but yeah, why would he? He didn't know Jerome would block with Steamkin. Yes. I'm Jerome putting the pressure on Emmanuel, or trying to. And he played a land, so yeah. So now for five. I saw a mutagenic growth in Emmanuel's hand. Does the one infect, uh, is that correct? Yeah. Okay. The they all got through for one point in <laughs> turn two. I think that's over now. Pump. Or maybe he plays cut shot. Yeah, he plays two cut shots, so maybe. Six. Five. What is it? No, it's mutagenic. It's enough. Now we have nine. <coughs> well, that went fast. One of the fastest games today. Cyborgs? Ah, cyborgs. <laughs> um, oh, I, I think uh, Emmanuel will bring more spell guides, relics, and maybe the spell peers. Count the more forces or something. Yeah. So what do you take out? I don't know. I don't. Ne I never know what to take out. So. Mm -hmm. Only know what I want to bring in. You don't have to take anything out, by the way. <laughs> uh, and. Isn't shape sanctuary very good? The normal spells. On your creatures? Yeah, sure, but you didn't see any removal spells on his creatures. Okay. But yeah, probably plays them, but... And he can take out Apostles' Blessing? Yeah, probably. But that's also good against removal, so... And then the Monoretic, what do you think he has to board? A braid, in? Anger, maybe. Molten Rain. And... Alpine Moons. What does Alpine Moon do? It's like a mini Blood Moon. It's for one red and then Chomp Land and then it can produce all colors. Mm -hmm. uh, but loses all its amount instead. Okay. A mountain that can tap for all colors. And f so if you if you can cast this on an Ink Mod, mm -hmm. all the other Ink Mods also have it. Ah, so they're all... They all, all with the same name have that effect. Yeah, then. so they all become 
Mountains. Oh, there it is on the screen. <laughs> cool card. Yeah. It's a very good sideboard card. Yeah. I think so. <coughs> modern, definitely In Legacy, I think it's uh, some decks better than. Yeah. That's a fantastic card against Strong anyway. And that's still one of the big players. So now it's colonnades being targeted off of control decks, possibly. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, ink bot nexuses, like you just said. Nexi. In, Nexi. In, in, Nexi. Nexi. Learn something new every day. <laughs> yes. My, my brain is a little bit cooked at the moment. But <laughs> and this is why Infect did so well, I think, today, because there aren't many combo decks. All quite mid rangey, and in fact, can win out of the blue. Same happens in Legacy, only faster. Yeah. Tomorrow it's Legacy. Ace yeah. will be playing Legacy. Yes. Kim will be playing Legacy. Yes. They will probably be playing the same deck in Legacy. More or less the same deck? No, we won't be playing the same deck. More or less, yes. But More or less. <laughs> we, I would small play. variant and the big mm. variant. Exactly like... I think she plays the big... Like she plays the big variant, I guess. Really? Really? Really. <laughs> Are you sure no colors? Showing all the colors. That's you, Taste the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. <coughs> yeah, that's for uh, another day. <laughs> <laughs> so, I didn't even see you again. Was it the Mono Red Phoenix? Yeah, it was because yeah. he was the number one seed. Who? The Joel Masanya. He was at six points in round four. Hmm. Which is weird. Maybe some droppers? I oh, know these are the parents for round four, so he's, he's six points after round three and got down there. There you see the ticks being handed out for the prize. Oh, ball. and Jerome already has Alpine Moon in hand, I guess. So I guess the top eight split it. Yeah, they split it. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. obviously because now they're, they're handing out the ticks on the camera. Ah, okay. And now they're only play playing and for the... Playmat. The and last device. chance to win this playmat, uh, playmat and then the buy and free entry of uh, the... And yeah. M series in Ghent later, or beginning next of next year. In, in Ghent, yes. Yeah. We're giving away those for modern legacy and vintage. But the modern, yeah, they don't interest me that much. The Other legacy vintage. ones, I can have tomorrow maybe. Yeah, maybe tomorrow. Our our Kim already has those. Yes, <laughs> maybe I'll get my second one tomorrow. Huh? You already have a buy. Yes. Where did you earn it? I earned it last Thursday. Oh. Where I won. Where? Four to zero. Where? Where? In the Magic Masters Mall Club here. Oh. Hmm. In our monthly legacy so event on the last Thursday of the month. So, no, it's one time I don't show up and you win everything. Yes. I wasn't also here, so it never <laughs> happened. It never happened. <laughs> <laughs> but still, I get to go for free. Of course, there was not enough resistance because we were. <laughs> <laughs> the guys will uh, disagree. <laughs> so the guys aren't here to defend themselves, so. <laughs> They're playing old school right now, I think. <laughs> yeah. So, Ron Mulligan puts Cry to the top. And the Hobbits are mounted goal. 
uh, the only has one mountain. <coughs> I think. But he has fate of little things. Let's go. There are the mountains. <laughs> there is a phoenix. Does he have a second one? Oh, oh yes, he has a second one, one I guess. Yeah. Is he willing to open it up to remove excellent effects? His opponent opened up strong as well, Panel Haven, Glistener Elf. Yeah. Please, you're not impressed. No, I'm, li I'm liking the red tech more. Hmm. It does have a on Nexus and Hunt as well, so the Alpine Moon can be very good. Could also be that the Alpine Moon needs to go on the panel even. If you Alpine Moon something, can they fetch for the... If you Alpine Moon... A fetch? No, no, no. You... Uh, take a... Uh, I don't know... Uh, Nexus. No, not that. You can't fetch an Ignite Nexus. Uh, a uh, fab. What's the what's the? The so what's the blue green fetch land again? Breeding pool. Breeding pool. So you want to fetch for the breeding pool, but you have an alpine moon out. Can you get it? The alpine moon on what? So he has already one uh, breeding pool in play with an alpine moon out. Yes. Yeah. If you. Yeah, it doesn't count as a mountain if it's not in play. <laughs> it's just because it's just a card with no otherwise it would type. be brilliant card mm -hmm. there we see more infectors how oh, look what's this, this? The oh it's molten rain yeah the molten rain thing pow Kablooey. two damage on your face mm -hmm. it's the new art yeah it's isn't it from where spellseeker has been printed what? The battle bomb thing? Uh, possible. I don't know. Molten rain. <laughs> nah, Modern Masters 2017. And there's a gut shot. Get him. He's gutted. Get it? Get it? <laughs> I got it. And there's the phoenix. Look at him go. No attack. Yeah, no, he wants to block. I think. Hmm. A long thing. Yeah. Is that so? Yeah. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, I wonder if they can figure out themselves if it works or not. At least they are lovely mountains this time, Dries. What? What? The mountains on General Mastonia's side. They are mm. lovely mountains, not the ones you had before with the pool deck. <laughs> yeah, indeed, but still the most cool mountains are those of Portal. Really nice. Hmm? The Ruby Knights. No. 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 <laughs> portal. First portal. Really? I like them the best. Are you playing those tomorrow? I will specially search them up for you. <laughs> Fabulous looting discarded what? Another Fabulous looting and. And uh, Steam That's the second one he has thrown in the graveyard. Is that the purpose of the Steamkin in this deck? Yes. I need something to throw away for lootings. 
Phoenix? Cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just throw this one. What does he have in hand then? I can't see it. Mind of old closer. Are you looking around the corner again? No, I was looking at Kim, but yeah, I was looking around the corner. He was looking around the corner. <laughs> <laughs> On this side, you can see the hand. <laughs> <Don't ask Jack. laughs> like at the start of the stream. The what? At the start of the stream, it was like leaning. <laughs> Both of us <laughs> leaning, trying to see the cards. <laughs> the little elf that could with the big goblins. Maybe we'd, we should uh, get Timmy a, a tablet so we can push in the cards the people have. In their hands? Yeah. Maybe we should get just hand cams. Hand cams. Yeah. <laughs> Please be yeah. That's a good idea, Jackie. <laughs> Why did they pick up all the cards? Because he w didn't block and he sh kicked him. Why didn't he block? He, he put know. the phoenix on the table and I said, Why didn't he attack? He said, Because he wants to block. Mm -hmm. And then he didn't block. I don't know. Yeah, what and happened. now he's dead, so he made he a didn't big mistake. I scooped, so. Okay, let's see. Uh, the backup table is 